everybody, long time no see, and today I am back with Title Tuesday. Let's have fun and let's Hello go. Hello, everybody, long time no see, and uh, today I am. Okay, how are you doing, everybody? Let's pause here. Okay, let's join. Three minutes till the start. Hello, everybody. Let's pause the stream here also. Okay, three minutes till the start. Already 476 players. It's pretty quite a lot because usually and Magnus, Hikaru, Firuja, Hans, Duda are all registered. So it's going to be an interesting tournament. Hello, I don't know my name five. So, hey Karmar. So quite a strong, uh, ah, quite a strong field. <laughs> And yeah, I have seen that Hikaru hit 3400 in Blitz. It's absolutely insane. Magnus was, at, if I'm not mistaken, like 3360, but Hikaru hit 3400. So that's very, very, very insane. And so far I am 67th starting seed. Hey, Logan! 20, uh, 22 months at year one. Thank you so much. How are you doing? Two minutes till the start. Already 530 players, guys. That's quite a lot. Because when I was playing, usually there was 530 at the end of the tournament. And Karmar! 70 months at year three. Thank you so much. Hi, Shogunat. Hello, Logan. Yeah, long time no see indeed. Thank you so much, guys, for the support. And we have one and a half minutes till the start. I gotta remember to turn on emote only during the games, though. <laughs> it's my biggest enemy in Title Tuesdays, emote only chat, you know. <laughs> and turning it on. Hi, Tree Level 2, Logan gifted 10 tier 1 subs. Thank you so much, Logan. Thank you, Logan. Ten gifted subs. Roller Bro, Arops, and Martin Blitz, Michael, uh, Rick727, Ethan, Eric, Sof, I don't know my name, 5, Shogunot, Ivan, in 17, and so hot has got them. Thank you, Logan. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Less than a minute till the start. Uh, Nihal Sarin also joined. Buddy Pranaf is here, so it's going to be an interesting tournament. Hold on, it says about to beat your last record. Uh huh. But the, it also says we are, we just complete level two. I don't know. Uh, let me check. Maybe he, eh, I don't know. <laughs> About to beat your last record, but in the activity feed it only says that we reach level two. So I don't know how that works, but <laughs> thanks a lot, Logan. Anyways, okay, fifteen seconds, guys. Still the start. So, so, so. I think it's about time we turn on emote only and yeah three seconds two one let's go 620 players at the moment we start and yeah let's go let's have six. Ah. Let's go D5. I mean, C5 is possible. Yeah, I'll probably go C5 now. He has this London setup. Hmm. Let's go Bishop D6. And Panda subbed at tier 3 for 52 months. Thank you. Castle. And uh, okay, I don't know. Queen C Queen seven, Bishop D seven. Yeah, Queen E two, and some ninety five stuff. Turn up the sound till seventy, and ninety five, Bishop H seven. I mean, I, I at least hope I'm not getting mated. 
I guess if I'm not, it's okay there. I don't know. He has knight g5, knight d3, queen d3, h7 hangs. g6, queen h3, h5, g4, knight d5, g8, queen. I mean, I don't know. It's, what will happen? We'll take. Okay, okay. If knight g5, I at least have h6, you know. So, like h6, and uh, what do we do? Uh, h6. What do you do? Uh, bishop h7, king h8, simply. Queen h5. I take e5, for example. Yeah, I think this is fine. At the very least, I'll have like king to f8 or something. So, hmm, we'll see. Yeah, okay. King h8. What is he planning to do? Queen h5? h takes g? Where does he move the bishop? What, or is he gonna go like h4 and just destroy me? Queen h8, queen h5? Or should I go king of eight simply? And maybe g, knight of three, g6 or something like that and king g7. Yeah, I think this is gonna be better than king h8. Queen h5, a g, h4. Maybe I, I'm winning there simply. But, but, it's a three plus, three plus two game, so there's not much time to think, you know? So I'll go king of eight. Because knight of three, g6, maybe the bishop may be trapped, I don't know. Ah, but he has queen e3 double attack, unfortunately. So, mm, we'll see. But okay, knight of three, I can maybe s perhaps simply develop his bishop d7. Huh. This guy really wants to destroy me. Uh, okay. I'm gonna take. He takes. Uh, okay. I've changed completely level 5. Okay, that's why I was close to the... Uh, and I got a new emo chat, that's great. Choo-choo. Thank you so much for the support. I, I mean, 94 looks interesting, but I think I may simply continue my development, you know? Oh, and Karma got the same meme? Oh, I'm not sure if he got it, but maybe he had it. So, very nice. Maybe I should have played Queen e7, Bishop d7 first. Time. It's a problem in Blitz. Okay, d4 I want to take on e5. I'm not sure if it's good because he may have f4. Some stuff like that. Oh my goodness, take 6-6, six, six, bishop d4. Uh -huh. Okay, then I'll go rook c8. This is scary, honestly. <laughs> this is really scary. I thought I can take, take, but then he has bishop d4 and a fork. time. Oh, time, time, time. I don't know, something like f5, if one puts on this h6 like rook e7. My idea is 94, I mean, looks uh, really fishy, you know, looks really, really, uh, I don't know, how, I don't want to say bad, but looks like, <laughs> very suspicious, very sus, is the word, oh uh, yeah, rookie 7, oh goodness me. Hi, Tanmai. F rook g8. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Okay, rook g8. I'm really afraid. But I, I think it's just... I just gotta play and hope. Here. Time trouble for both already. It's gonna be, oh, yes, right to castle. Uh, that's gonna be fun. <laughs> Mm 
bishop e8, so rook f7 I take, and this hangs. Queen h3, bishop g6, queen h6, king e8, I don't know. Just gotta hope. <laughs> That's how most of my games go. I just do some moves and then hope. <laughs> but okay, so far I'm two bishops up. And then I have this 97, I guess? Uh, 97, bishop d4, queen f4? And it should be winning. This is, I feel like it's somehow, just somehow it should be. And I want it! 28, 50, just go! Yes! Let's go! Okay, emote only off. I turn my cat, thanks for the follow. Whew! I, I, that was a very fishy game. 3 plus is 3 to 0. Yeah, it's been a while indeed, Gage. Yeah, I'm fine, Neon. Logan also got the emote, nice! Mmm. It was a nice win, but it was extremely, 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 extremely suspicious as a position at one point, I may say. Uh, yes. Yeah, the sack didn't work. Got a new emote. Nice! Okay, king h5. This, uh, king h8, queen h5, a g h4. And what do I do is a question. I have g4, which I missed. But apparently he has f4. <laughs> yeah, Chad, this is fun. b6 is the best move. Okay, what happens if I take g takes f? Castle. Oh, and he takes f4. Okay, yeah, but okay. So I played king of 8, which was an inaccuracy. Apparently, king h8 was the best. Queen h5, blonde, and knight of c was better. Bishop d7, I should have played. Oopsie daisy. I should Instead of bishop d7, I should have pushed immediately. And if f4, b6, rook d8, king e8, bishop b7, king d7, king c8. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, it's fishy, but okay. d4, h. Yeah, that was tricky. I couldn't take because he takes, takes bishop d4. I thought I'm winning here, but then I see that my knight's hang and I just cannot protect both of them. So I played rook a c8, f4. Then somehow, somehow I wasn't lost here. And rook h7 was a blunder here to take rook g8. Mama mia, bishop h7, because if I take then king e2, and somehow I'm not losing anyways because of queen f8, queen h6. Uh, but okay, he played rook h7 after bishop eight, I won. <laughs> yeah, that was a crazy game. But I gotta win, and that's what matters, I guess. Uh, why can't I click on early title Tuesday? <laughs> ah, they are, okay. A little lucky, I guess, or something. Okay, that's a draw. Oh, I played this guy in the last title Tuesday. I played he was a 2600. Now he's a 2750. So, nice. Good for him. Let's watch Harry Rackel. Okay, there should be another draw. What country is that? Wow, I have never heard of that country. I am sorry to all the residents there, but I've never heard of it. Maybe it's not even a country. I'm not sure. Maybe it's some flag, but I am truly sorry if if there are residents of that country. Didn't mean to hurt anyone. Why should move the knight? Why don't they move 91, 92, 93, 94, huh? They think that would be nice. No, try, try, try moving the knight. Yeah, but now you cannot because the bishop protects e1. Hey, king d5, now that's simply... Yeah, but... Ah, no, but... Ah! Why trick black? Because now they win a pawn. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but now knight h4, this is... Why not knight h4? But now take the bishop. Yeah, but I think... Ah, okay, knight c4, okay, they already, white tried it. Bishop c7, everything holds, fair enough, yeah. If if white tried it, then, then it works, but they managed to trick black, and they won, so good for them. And is there any games left? 651 players, that's a lot. Oh, but I'm extremely laggy, guys, extremely, extremely laggy. Hello? Chat, is it just me or is chesscom in general laggy? During the game it was fine, but now I cannot click anything. Eh, okay, it's super big delay. Lost the 17th piece. 
Hello. I'm click. Look, I'm clicking. I'm literally clicking. But nothing is clicking in. <laughs> yeah, I do. Aha. Okay. The the it says the page doesn't work. Doesn't doesn't answer. Chat is just comment or is it just me? I mean, I guess if the stream is going, then I'm okay. But you never know. Can somebody please check if it's just me who is down? Oh, I got an opponent. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice chat. I'm berserking. I'm not not quite, but I'm somewhat berserking. One minute time odd. Yippee. Yippee chat. You see, you wanted me to berserk. Here it happened. Well, not really a berserk, just a 59.3 second uh, odd, but technically almost a berserk. Oh, it's saying before, but okay, it takes. Why am I hang keeping my knight hanging? I don't know. I'm not sure about bishop before. It looks interesting, at least. I'm not sure about queen c6. As you know me, I'm a, a pawn grabber. Okay, I don't want to trade queens. This guy is also streaming, by the way. Yeah, a bit unfortunate that I lost a minute <laughs> without thinking because as you know me as well if you know me you know that I'm a pawn grabber and you know as well that I love thinking in title to just the games but I have one minute less to think in this game so okay let's hope that it shouldn't matter much this minute because it may matter queen d7 looks interesting G6, I'm here, I'm gonna be willing to take. I, I lagged. I lagged for like a minute. <laughs> uh, and yeah, I started the game pretty much a minute down. Queen C7, he had rook G6. Maybe I should just simply go rook C1, and rook G6, G3. I want to go queen B7, but after queen E7, like, queen trade was pretty much. Yeah, now I was thinking g3. Because, I mean, he doesn't have any knights or bishops which can use these squares. So, hopefully it will be fine. Mmm! Goodness me, guys! Remind me that I have to turn on emote only. <laughs> it's annoying, to say the least, to remember every single game to turn it on, but... The rules are the rules. You either accept them or you just don't play it until Tuesday. Ah, <laughs> my my precious minute, where have you been when I needed you? Now when I need it, it's not here. Should we like rook c7? It's going to fine. Maybe. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. Okay. <laughs> plan B. I think I lost the pawn, unfortunately, with this plan B chat, but... Uh, Yeah, Miss Queen 5 nice move from my opponent. Yes, and I have to give this pawn away, unfortunately. But some double slash triple attacks, maybe it's not as bad. Because maybe I'm missing it, but so far I don't see a move how he can protect both the e4 and the a7 pawn, because rook e6, f7 is saying it, so maybe, maybe I'm not even a pawn down, then it's fine. But it's definitely a bit annoying that I have this f2 weakness. Yeah, okay, takes... Yeah, now he wants to check, maybe. Um, so maybe I should have traded queens when I had the moment for it. This queen e5. Just want to trade the queens. Yeah, I don't know. Rook b1 h3 is what annoys me, so I guess I'll take. It's also not the pawn, e5 pawn is not the pawn I really wanted to give away. 
but uh. hmm. yeah this minute would definitely help oh king g5 king g6 idea D2, root B5, rook F2, root B6, king G7, H5, or... Okay, I have a force draw. Yeah, chat. Uh, I'm not a fan of making a draw. But okay, I have 11 seconds. Okay, maybe he will play on. Then I'll play like h5 or something. Okay, I can give checks. I didn't have time at all. Because of lag, I lost a minute. <laughs> so, yeah, I have h5 at least with the draw if he continues king e7. Because I don't want to over push, you know. King e5, king g7, rook h2. He has two scary passers. Just scary. <laughs> if you didn't know. H5, H2 will take, take. I mean, I think it should be fine anyways. And that his pawn yeah, a tad bit too far. Yeah, h6 is risky with rook g2 with g6 checks. Ah, why didn't I play king f3? Yeah, draw. Yeah, I could have pushed more for a win. But I started a minute down, so this minute would definitely help to sing. I think it was a decent game anyways. 96.6. Yeah, I was slightly better here somewhere. I got this open file. Rook save was a mistake. Ah, okay, yes, okay, right. Rook c7 attacking this and a7 hangs. I just missed a way to win a pawn because we got pretty much the same position. Again, should play like queen c7. So, queen c7, if queen e7, I have rook c1, I think. I oh, know I take and rook c1. But yes, in, yeah, rook c7 attacking f7 and attacking a7. Yeah, yeah I missed that, but then, then it was equal. I took that check. Yeah, rook 7. Rook 7, rook f6, rook a7. And pretty much the exact same position, only he wouldn't have the a7 bone. <laughs> okay. Where? Protect both pawns with the queen. Ah, here, right? Queen c2. Queen c2, yes, but rook f2. And I cannot take the rook. So I have to take, take, and I'm pawn, uh, pawn down. Okay, rook c7, but these two hang, it just doesn't work. Yeah, queen c2 would be a great move. But, but okay, rook f1, queen b7, I haven't lost the pawn anyways. Fortunately for me. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, but okay, rook c7. I don't know how I missed it. I, I was worried of some rook g6, but then yeah, simply g3. <laughs> yeah, rook c7, 
137 winning a pawn still it would be tricky but I mean practical chances are good because even if you would trade queens and trade these pawns I'd have a D passer he'd have a weakness on E4 so there would be chances but okay <coughs> <coughs> At least I didn't lose it. I was a bit worried that I would lose it in time trouble somewhere. Okay. <coughs> uh, it should be a draw, but I have a feeling somehow white will grind it out. King g6, rook g5, king h6, rook g4, bam, 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 that's a draw. Okay, so I didn't grind it out. Ah, king g5, h6 was interesting, but yeah, it should be. It should be just a draw now. <coughs> Chat, will we go till move 150 in this game or no? That's a big question. I'm not sure. Not really interested, honestly. Rook f5. Yeah, rook f3. I mean, I think it's still a... Yeah, now it's still a draw, just rook g2. I... 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 I mm. The bridge now can be built. Perhaps, or maybe not. Just keep the rook on the g-file and give fight any, don't give fight any chances. Rook g2, just a draw. King f7, important. Yes, and then king f8, king f7, move the rook. It's a draw. Okay, chat, we are eight moves away from move 150. Eight moves away. White, wait. Is Black tried to lose or what? And I think they managed. Rook h1, king g6. Rook g1, king h5 resigns. And then rook f5. My goodness. Rook f5. Yeah. Yeah, Black, Black, Black just had to keep the rook all the time on the g-file. They didn't, they lost. Okay, okay, now let's hope I won't lag and won't uh, lose a minute of my time. Please, just come. Okay, I got the opponent immediately. That's good. Thanks, the 17th piece, emote only. <sighs> I have two bars, that's why probably. But still, even with two bars, losing a minute on move one by lag is unfortunate. <laughs> to say the least. What do I play after bishop h4? Hmm. <coughs> eh, d4 will hang. If knight d7, I'm not sure if it's good, but knight seven. Ah. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's good. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> I'm gonna stop my speech there. Just not sure if it's good because, but I don't know if there's anything better. Maybe I have g3, queen d8, steel, d4 hangs. It's a weakness. Okay, knight c7, rook b8, rook d1, perhaps. Then G for hang, uh, hangs, uh, holds, I think. And maybe I can play like G3, Bishop B2. Okay, he takes here. Here I'm thinking Knight F5, so maybe I can develop my Knight to G3. And then develop, but put it there. Okay, he wants to... Uh, do not to make me castle-less for the rest of the game. And that's definitely poor English, but guys, I haven't practiced in a while, so sorry about that. <laughs> 96. 96, 96, I take rook c8. Should be to castle. He'll have annoying pawns. Maybe I can play b3 this, queen d2, c3, queen c2. Queen 
That's strange. Ah, yes, knight of six. Yes, knight of six immediately, and then queen e five, queen two, bishop of five. Okay. Left knight g3, queen e5, queen d2, c3, queen c2, I'm fine. So maybe after knight g3, I'm fine in general. I'm not sure. We'll see. And knight g3 protecting e4 square. Maybe it actually I should have played simply knight f3 and after c4 b3. Bishop of 5 seems like queen. Ah, but okay, yeah, he's bishop of 5. Eh. Okay. Mm. Bishop e2, queen e5, queen d2. Yeah, I think it should be fine. My idea is just to undermine his pawn chain with a4 after castle. So I want him not to check me from a5, so I can. Okay. <laughs> Did the exact opposite, but okay, I think queen d2 is needed. Because otherwise, eh, otherwise I'm castleless. So, yeah, take six. A four. So take I take. Actually, A four looks quite interesting. He has A six. He has A six though. So maybe it's not as interesting. Maybe I can go like Rook B one or something. Uh. Hmm. E4, so if takes, I take C4, take King E3. I'm not sure if it's good, I'll have a weak default pawn, but okay, if C takes B, I think I either can play E5, and that's probably what I will play, because <laughs> I don't see any alternatives. Yeah, I think it's, okay. it's an interesting move. But I'm as well undermining his pawn chain, because this is the the root of the pawn chain. So this e5, b2, rook b1 and takes. This e5 anyways may be interesting with future b4, with future b4 and then king c3 and if c3 I go king c2 and something like that. Yeah, it looks fine to me. Hopefully it, hopefully it won't only look fine but also be fine. Yes, I was thinking a3, because king c3, a takes b check. Aha, uh -huh. king c3. I think king is a good block, eight piece at least here. And then maybe I can transform my, transport my knight. <coughs> uh, but he wants to, mm -hmm, he wants to go rook, b8, rook a8 and a takes b. <coughs> mm -hmm. Hi. <clears throat> Tricky. Tricky. Ah, time. Time, 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 time. I don't know what to play. <laughs> oh! Yeah, that wasn't a good move. Oh, and b4. Ah, oh, and bishop of 5. I just walked under and it's everything he wanted. Hmm. Yeah, that wasn't a good game. I just walked literally under everything. I thought for 40 seconds I walked under a check, and then I walked under another check, another check, another check. Yeah, 
It's a terrible game. Oh yeah, but my opponent played very, very well as well. Hmm. Yeah, that wasn't great. <laughs> Yeah, but what what would I play here? Because okay, I get King C, Rook A six, and then suddenly he has Rook eight. Yeah. Yeah, ninety five for my opponent. He played pretty well, but couldn't say the same about myself. I should have taken Bishop E seven. Yeah, but Bishop F three and what is the idea of Bishop F three? Rook Rook A eight simply. D five is an angle. Should have seen pretty much just nothing. Okay, it's better than knight f1 walking under a b check. Yeah, but 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 okay, okay. Let's say I'm waiting. I'm waiting. A takes b. I cannot take rook falls. This rook a4 a3 falls. I want to transfer my knight. My idea was after this 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 I go king b4 king c5. Ah, but that's mating too. Yeah, that was a terrible game. <laughs> Hmm. Bishop F3 would be worse. What I did, I was worse, so it was a good game. I should have taken Bishop B7 instead of 95. 95, he just got advantage. Okay. Draw maybe? No. Draw. Okay. Okay, black one. Wow! Four queens on the board. This is fun, chat. Whoa. White were completely winning, I guess. Then now we have... Okay, now we have only two queens. Should be a draw. Okay, <laughs> I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Emote only. Ah, it's still one game going. Not for long. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's play a better game than the last one. Because, yeah, I should have taken bishop e7 and then I would be fine ish. All right. We go D for E for Knight F3. I don't know. We'll see. Probably like two seconds. Exactly two seconds. Okay, D4. Okay, E6, D5. Gonna take us night before. Oops, and I can either get my knight to d6 or if I want to to e6. I'll see, depending on the position. I guess he wants e4. So perhaps either I put two knights and then a rook on e8, and that's fine. Or I put now I think okay, knight of six looks fine, and then get the other knight here. Because knight e6, e4 takes, you can take, takes d. b3? So I guess he wants to take away the c4 square for my knights. Okay, knight e8, e4, I'll take, take, take. Like queen d7, knight d6. My idea is simply to go here, control the e4 square with like rook e8. I turn on emote only, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay, 
he didn't even want to play e4 as it turned out but the d6 square the d and d6 and d3 is absolutely best position for the knight in these pawn structures so i should be quite happy with it i, I guess <laughs> And b5, I want to go knight c4. Because these two squares are holes in his position where my pieces can jump. If I go knight c4, then perhaps b4 will be a weakness. And I may get a passed pawn on c4. So it looks interesting. Because as we see, simply plays b5, he should be fine. Um... Um, 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 yeah, queen b2 is a nice move, protecting the pawn. I don't queen b7. So that if he takes the knight on c4, my queen and my rook will already attack the pawn. Because knight c4 now he would have b5. Maybe at rook ab, I don't know. I'm not sure if about, about queen b7, whether it's good or not. I gotta take. And now rook b8. Ah, but should be at queen e3, knight c4, queen e7. I don't know about this. <laughs> okay, takes queen a2. Okay, this pawn will be a weakness. I just gotta find two squares from which I can attack it. And then it's good, if, if, or, or not. If I don't, then I'm not gonna trade the queens. Yeah, I didn't find the second square from where I can, I could attack the, the pawn, unfortunately. <coughs> okay, king of eight, so there is no e4. Still cannot find the second square <laughs> to attack the pawn. So 
still looking for it. Yeah, I thought I was winning, but no. <laughs> I thought he blundered. Okay, chat, it's still not over. Some practical chances. <laughs> Some maybe progress, perhaps? <laughs> no, of course it is still a dead draw. Let's not flag. Okay. <sighs> yeah. I thought I was winning with. I thought he blundered 93. But no. Yeah, that was a very, very comfortable position to play. But unfortunately, there was no second square to attack the before pawn from. So it didn't work. Oops. Yeah, no, yeah. There was not much room to blunder, unfortunately. Okay, he, I made a blunder, but he didn't. He didn't uh, th think there was a blunder. So, oh, it's already break time. All right, guys. I will see you in a few minutes.
Hello everybody, still a minute left, okay, so I was like running second to second. Yes, I had some advantage, 0 0.5, oh no, just on not like, thank you. I had 0 0.9 advantage, and uh, what should I have played? Yes, this is this, and then like rook b8, I guess. Uh, is it really advantage? Is it really advantage, huh? <laughs> 0 0.2, completely win advantage. A Coco Melon, it's very dangerous here with constant sirens, bombing every day, every minute, every hour, every hour, every minute. So it is not super safe to stream. But okay, today, today is quite uh, an okay day. So let's hope, let's hope they will be quite okay chess as well. <laughs> uh, emote only, yes. My favorite thing to do in Tidal Tuesdays. Let's try something new. I haven't repeated this line in a while. <laughs> Aye. Oh no. Chat, I haven't repeated this line like ages. <laughs> so. Was it knight f3, bishop e7, e5 for castle? I think I missed, I think it's knight f3. After e6, knight f3. Ah, whatever. At least I'm making him think, you know. I just gotta gotta hope that this one minute advantage won't won't just disappear like in the previous game. <laughs> we'll see though. Why do you have two? Ah. This pawn isn't hanging. I mean, it is, but it isn't really. Chat, I, I don't know if this is good. <laughs> I, I messed up my lines. And so, I'm just, just playing. Yes, queen of three. Am I missing something? I hope not. Ah, rook a seven. I did miss something. Maybe 9g5 was better though, I don't know. Yeah, perhaps 9g5 simply, simply gave almost a winning advantage. But still, my king is somewhat safe even though he has a queen on a2. It's more or less safe, meanwhile his king is in the center, so I don't know. Oh, what? Knight f7? Knight of 7 take the is there is c4 for him. 
and bishop a3 ideas. Queen e6, bishop a3. A d a is knight c3. I, I would, of course, grab on f7, but I am not exactly sure whether I'm fine after c for bishop a3, you know. Okay, if queen e5, then perhaps knight f7 is better, since I already have my knight somewhat nearby, and then he'll, his queen also will be far away. Queen B8, Bishop B3. Yeah. All right, I messed up the line to one. Okay. Whew. I mean, I'm not sure whether it was a great game. Here, Knight F3, Bishop B7, E5, I think. I know, castle. Knight of three, bishop e seven, castle, castle, then e five. Not right. Yeah, I think so. I don't remember. GG's, thank you. Okay. Okay, queen e two. Yes, I probably had something better. Perhaps I had queen f two. Ah no, okay, Stockfish now says he was, yeah, okay, Queen of 2 was slightly better. Queen of 3, c6, c6, I was worse, he had to take Bishop d6, then knight e2, knight c3, Queen c5, a miss, Rook c7, he was slightly better, we both missed King d7, but then I won. Okay, it wasn't a perfect game, but but I think he practically was good, I got him to time trouble and bam, I won. <laughs> yeah, Magnus should hold this. Yeah, it's gonna be boring to watch. Let's watch Duda, who should win. Ay! 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 What a miss from both players, 96. Simply won the game for why? Okay, maybe not simply won, you still had to try, but now black wins. Ay! 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 <laughs> Blitz is cruel. Yeah, nice win from Duda. Magnus Drew. So just Bogdan Deak. Ooh, nasty. How do you win this? Oh, nasty! Yeah, I thought Bogdan is winning, but... And BIM episode is 61! So, tier 1, thank you so much! How are you doing? Five years already! That's huge! What's up? Yeah, now I think White is winning. Guinea 5, GG's, no? Yeah, Rook D6, yep, okay. F4. That's nice. Now rook g6 wins. Yeah. Uh, it's it's winning. White still has to win, but so which Nihal Sarin, which most likely, whose game will most likely end in a draw. 
Not many games left, I mean, there are some, but... <laughs> Let's watch... Ah, no, Lily ended her game. I don't know, let's watch this game. Yeah. Wait... How did White Black lose this? Hey Pookie, how are you? Ah! I believe just blunt an eye, that's unfortunate. Okay, chat. This is probably gonna be the game of the round. I mean, not the game of the round in excitement, mine was more exciting. <coughs> but uh, the game of the round on the length. <laughs> But okay, usually when it's rook v rook and nobody accepts the draw, it was some somebody was winning until suddenly they were <laughs> okay draw. Okay, maybe it's not the longest game of the round. And Bimi, I'm giving it here once up to Pookie. Thank you, thank you, Bimi. Thank you. Okay, that's a win for black. Ah, uh, chat. Uh, unfortunately, it's time for emo only. <laughs> It's time for emote only. Already 179 gifted subs from Beam Episode on the channel. It's huge. Thank you very much, Beam Episode. Oh dear, why does everybody go for D4 today? You guys, do you not know how to play other openings? <laughs> Whoa, okay, A3. I mean, not that I'm... Not that I mind, because I'm playing Bishop E7 line anyway, so... <laughs> not like it matters much to me, but... To people who play Bishop before it, sure. Sure does matter. I'll try to play with the knight. I honestly like I'm I'm technically playing these positions from both sides, right? Because I'm sometimes getting these positions with white, and I'm playing this with black. And honestly, I like playing with the knight more. Because the bishop does, doesn't really do much. Let's say it like, let's state it like that. It's okay, it's an okay piece, but it doesn't, it certainly doesn't do too, too much. Mm -hmm. Okay, then I'll simply play G6, I guess. <laughs> I don't want to get mated, you know. Because Queen D3, okay, it wasn't a threat or anything. Maybe it was a false alarm for me. But the 94, yeah, I definitely maybe shouldn't have played G6. But my idea was something like this. In general, so maybe it's even good that I play G6. <laughs> so Queen F3 doesn't attack my knight. And then boom, kapam, kapam. Uh huh. That's a sudden switch of sides. Okay, can maybe I should do this. I'm not sure because c5 is there. Uh, c5 square is there. But... Hmm. So you'll be like all in or something. I don't know if I want to go all in or play it more, more calmly. 
Let's go queen e6, so I have a d7 for my knight just in case. And then rook h8, h4, all this stuff. But I give, gave f4 square, which isn't too good to give away. But unfortunately, I did so. Okay, let's go rook a6, rook b6. I mean, I'm, if I play rook b6, I'm somewhat trapping my rook. <laughs> okay. For content, I, I, I will do anything. Now queen d7, because rook c5 isn't a threat. In my opinion. Because I can simply take, then my rook is 3 then I'm just chilling. But at least I have b6 square for my rook, just in case something something will be, if something gets too fishy, I have b6. Perhaps an idea is like knight e4, then like h4, all that stuff. Okay, bishop e2. Interesting. Rook e4, if queen b8 I go... Uh-huh. And what do you play after knight e7, may I ask? Isn't the queen just trapped? Or am I missing something? My rook somewhat trapped by his b6. What does your queen have? Okay. Okay, let's do knight f6. Let's not relax too early. Still gotta win the game, but it's still definitely very nice to just get a queen like that. I was preparing for a long ride in an endgame. Bam! Queen is gone. Okay, if, if 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 my rook won't get trapped uh, stuck there anymore, then this is just GG yeah, on the spot. Okay, I may just simply move my knight to win b2 because the bishop does absolutely nothing on f3. And I have b6, <laughs> just in case, <laughs> just in case I have b6, guys, for my rook. Maybe I'll actually go here, so it's more relaxed atmosphere. I don't know if this was good or not, but now I can play queen f6. Uh, now, now simply queen b1, gg, because the pawn is gone, and that's resignable. with the game. I think I played it well. As, as you see, guys, I told you that the knights are a pretty nice piece in these pawn structures. Okay. Ninety-four dot five. Okay, I'm happy. Yeah. I, I was slightly better in <laughs> dunk. <laughs> bishop b1, yeah, okay, bishop b1 was a mistake, g6, king g7, I'm having like 0 0.7 advantage. Okay, this rook maneuver was fishy, but, but yeah, rook e4, I was already better here. <laughs> yeah, I... Yeah, I was I was preparing for a long grind, but my opponent decided to make it much easier for me. Wait a sec, the knight I just lost. They are completely lost. Nice skills from Firuja. A new gifter giving a tier one sub to Barag Baragal Magnus. Thank you, Anim's gifter. Appreciate it. Okay, uh, Narayanan is trying something, but I think Firuja will be successful in winning the game. <laughs> Wasn't actually Bishop D8 simply checkmate. Okay, there is F5, but I think 93 F5 is made. I mean, that's a brilliant mate if it is. And 
Anders Eve to give the dear ones up to Naki Pulahan. Thank you, Anders Eve. Thank you. Yeah, Firuji did win it indeed. Well done. It was close from Narayanan, but then he just blundered a knight in one move pretty much. Magnus is on five and a half. Hikaru is on five. I don't know. Are any big streamers playing? I don't think so. So charts in the winter. In the title Tuesday Veranish one, he was doing extremely well till the I Rugi stream. Ayy! Rook d3! Always check checks, guys! Hi, Biagio, how are you doing? R3 is a bit pushy. I'm not sure if it's good, because I think he's playing with fire. I don't know why black isn't playing knight e2. There you go. But now knight e4 doesn't win a pawn. King d4. King e3, resignable. 92, Ugh. King D3, 92, okay, yeah, I think Arthur just had to go for a draw, he was a little bit too risky, and he lost, awfully, <laughs> why is that, oh, this is interesting, I played Hikaru once, I got destroyed. There's a video on my YouTube channel about that, by the way. So go check it out. I got destroyed by Hikaru. <laughs> oh, Mubot, what a nice plug! <laughs> Mubot plugged the YouTube channel exactly. Okay. <laughs> I just said that didn't Mubot plugged the YouTube channel. I mean, that, what a timing, chat. <laughs> oh, it's like flagged. That's unfortunate. All right, chat. Emote only. I'm sorry if we didn't talk much, but it's title Tuesday rules. Let's go E4 again. you go bishop c4 if I'm not mistaken and then oops almost mouse slip seems like 92 boom 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 if I'm not mistaken I haven't checked these lines in over over three four months so I may be mistaken very much yes here you go a4 because you don't want to lose your bishop you don't mind uh, I think castling first is okay Knight c3 and an f4 idea. Yeah. But f4 anyways. Maybe d takes c was actually better. I'm not sure about that, guys. I pre-move bc, but maybe dc was better, so I have the control over the d file. e4 pawn is a weakness, but maybe it was better. I'm not sure. I haven't checked my lines that deep, my lines are like max 10 moves. <laughs> so, <laughs> even if I would remember the lines, I don't, I don't think I, I had this in my lines. A5 is an interesting idea, if I'm not mistaken, these pawn structures. Whoa! I'm getting, I'm getting the D5 square. I this is tempting me. Knight C7? Can't I simply take the Knight C3 Knight D5? So, like, good luck. I92! Oh, but he didn't find it. Okay, now knight c3 and a knight d5. Good luck getting my knight away from d5 square. He had knight e2 first. 
Okay, sure, I, I probably had some edge with some take take queen h5 stuff. Uh, this queen f2 simply. And then knight d5. If this, I'll go like rook b1. It looks quite, quite, quite uh, promising. Oh my goodness, I cannot speak English, guys. <laughs> I forgot how to speak English. Take CS Queen C3, nice idea, but I'll go ninety five. Yeah, I understand. I will have weak. I will have absolutely terrible dark squares. But look at my knight. Look at this beast on D five. Look at this beast. It's an absolute beast on D five. Uh, maybe h was wasn't good. Uh, but I still have the beast. And he cannot trade it because he has a dark square bishop. That's good. Kapow. Maybe I should play rugby one win a pawn. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit ambitious this game. Maybe a bit over ambitious. But, uh, yeah, I, I just can't get enough of my beast. Yeah, he has queen e5. Maybe I shouldn't have allowed that. But on the other hand, what if I take, take, rook b1, oops, rook b1. He goes like rook, I don't know, rook b8, I don't know which rook, but probably a rook. Uh, knight e7, knight f5. I know, that's not nice. I don't know, guys. It's it's interesting. I'm excited to play this, honestly. I'm a pawn down, but I have a beast. An absolute beast. Maybe I should have played... Uh, yes, maybe I should have played rook h5 first. So now his bishop is playing. Ah, I'm, I, I think I'm a bit... Maybe I'm a bit too overambitious. Uh, because now f5... I still have a beast, but maybe I'm a tad bit over optimistic slash over ambitious. I don't know. Yes, f5, and he will have hook f7 stuff. Ideas with rook of seven, rook of seven. He takes immediately, okay, C4 anyways.
beast is still on the board. It's not such beast as he was once was, but it's still a pretty strong knight. Ay! Ay! Ah! <laughs> yeah, I was too, 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 we're having too much fun this game. I get to, to, yeah, I don't know. Get too excited. And this guy doesn't like stalemates. Yeah, I was probably win at some point. I, I should have been a bit more careful. Rook h5, I think, instead of rook b6, probably would give me a, quite a comfortable advantage. Okay, it's not winning. But I think I was winning. Because I had such a great night. Yeah, I was... Okay, I wasn't like winning, I was plus two. So that's pretty much almost winning. Yes, okay, h4, bishop h6. I shouldn't... Ah, I shouldn't have actually taken. I should have checked knight f5. And then take the bishop, take the pawn. This hangs, this hangs, this will hang after queen f6. Okay. And then queen d4. Rook f3 mistake. Yeah, I should have played rook a b1. I got too carried away. Uh, take, take, take. Rook b1. I should have played king f2 immediately. And uh, then my advantage... Okay, I had king f3, I should have played king f3 here. I was thinking I was a bit worried, but yeah, I would have two beasts now, you know. Uh, yeah, okay. It was an interesting game nonetheless. I had knight, yeah. No, but I think I was doing fine. Okay, I had king e4 like a million times. I was doing fine. Up until here, I completely blundered rook d4. Just knight f6, rook g1, king f5, I'm fine. Great, I'm rich. Uh, uh, seven months at year one, thank you so much. I'm doing fine, how about yourself? I mean, I'm doing not so fine in this game. I was fine, uh, even winning, then I just made a one move blunder. Simply could have tried. Oops, 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 oops. Simply could have tried grinding it out. I'm winning even, so practically it would be difficult for my opponent to play. But I blundered, but okay. It was fun playing at least. How are you doing, by the way? How are you doing yourself? Okay, can somebody please play E4 if I get black? Please! I'm, uh, I'm tired of D4. Somebody play E4. Please! Life and well, okay. Same, honestly, here. <laughs> okay, E4, please, E4, please, E4, please. <laughs> okay, at least it's not D4. <laughs> Don't you dare play D4. Okay. Righty stuff. Why does nobody play E4? Isn't it like the... the... Huh? Isn't like the most uh, popular popular opening in the world? One e four. Well, not yeah. Most popular first move, let's say. I'm certainly sure that. Uh, it's something I haven't played before, which is fun because I'm honestly tired of uh, the same stuff. Bishop five. Do you play? Queen before. Okay, if he takes, I take. Two bishops eventually, I'll be happy. A3, I have queen c4. I win a pawn, I guess. Unless I'm missing something. Knight d1. Knight a4, a3, queen b3. Also looks fine. <sighs> a b3 
bit disappointed still from the last game. I got such a beast and I didn't win with it. Like how? Yet simply 97, 95. The bishop can never move. He doesn't have g6. He doesn't have anything. And I managed to lose that. How? <laughs> but okay. Let's at least have a good game now. Okay. Queen c4. B3. But the knight doesn't hang. What is the idea? What am I missing? Because c5 knight doesn't hang at all. Yeah, but now bishop e6. I'm a pawn up. I mean, a pawn for nothing. Don't mind if I do. Queen d3 looks interesting. Then they have bishop e3. Okay, single go queen d3. So like rook d8, maybe b5. Yeah, rook d8. If bishop e1, queen e6. If bishop e3, I'll take c3. Oh, wait, bishop f1? Okay, bishop e1. If bishop e1, I think queen a6. If bishop f1, seems like b5. At the very least, should be okay. I was worried about bishop f1, but I have bishop and queen of 3 at least there, and then queen h5 or something. Okay, this I have knight d3. I also have rook d1 with the idea after queen d1 to go like queen to a3 or something. Which looks interesting. I have b5 and after takes, takes, I will take a1. I'll be an exchange up. So perhaps b5 is the move to go with the idea of queen b6. Knight d3 was interesting, but I was a bit worried with the pin. Queen b6. Yeah, I want to make him take on d8. This. Ah, maybe I could have won it s easier, simpler than here. But I'm not sure. Okay, let's let's go to the end game, I guess. Is the camera looking? It's looking good. Queen e2, knight e5, and then bishop g4. That looks quite nice. Nice regrouping of my knight. Okay, he has h3 with. Ah, but he doesn't have f4 because my queen on b6 is pinning it. Uh, but bishop g4, no f3 for him. There is no f3, and I'm winning an exchange, and that should be quite a chill position with an extra ex yeah but now simply ah maybe it's not so simple hold on we should be two to take my d3 yeah it should be quite fine and then simply play e5 so his bishop is restricted completely with some bishop c5 ideas putting pressure yeah okay so go rook f1 then queen e5 this should be over pretty soon, hopefully. And the knight is trapped. Yeah, I think that was a good game. I'm happy with it. Maybe, maybe I gave him a bit too many chances with this queen e3. Perhaps I could have won it a bit simpler, but... But whatever, I, uh, a win is a win, right? Did you think you? Yeah, I think that was... I mean, the last game was also very great. I, I love the last game, but ah, it was so close yet so far. Yeah, I was plus four. Huh? Oh, bishop g4? Ah, bishop g4, right. f3 I simply take. This I go queen d4 and then rook d8. He can resign. And I'm at least an exchange up. Like here. And rook d1 I'm trading every. Yeah, he can resign there. Of your did I make a did I ever make a quote or what do you mean with my quote yeah rook a d bishop yes he he activates I made him activate a bit turn of the computer turn on the computer yes yeah, that's true but maybe some people are playing from phone but yes true turn on the computer is the most uh, popular yes and then he just blundered but yes bishop g4 was a nice move which I missed which would win easier. 
Ooh, Magnus Firuja, that's spicy. Knight of five? Doesn't this just win? <laughs> not there, not there. Yeah, Magnus should be winning. Oh, and that's round eight. Ooh, break. <sighs> Rookie seven. <laughs> Wait, what is Magnus doing? Rook D7? <gasps> Chat! Rook D7. Magnus missed Rook D7. Dude, I saw that. Not to brag or anything. <laughs> Oi! But Magnus won in the end. But Rook D7, Magnus! Ay, ay, ay! Ay, ay, ay! Ay, 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 ay! Terrible play for Magnus. Blundering a piece. Very, very bad. <laughs> Oi, I misclicked. Wait, it's just come so laggy. Yeah. Mm. This is interesting. I think Narayanan should win this, but eh, you never know. 97, that's a weird looking move. Where's your top position? Eh? What do you mean? Mamma mia! What a blunder! Entitled Tuesday. 20th, if I'm not mistaken. 20th for. Oh my goodness, why do black wins this? <laughs> wow. So white had to draw pretty much in like 30 bazillion ways. They lost? Wow. 20th. Hi, Akaras. How are you doing? Maybe 19th, 18th, I don't remember. 20th for sure, but maybe maybe a bit higher. I don't think I'm getting it this time, though, because, yeah, long time no see, uh, long time no play. King of six. King of six. Bishop of five. Okay, and the final game of the round. Is it still going or no? Okay, it should. It's, it's still going, but it should end soon. All right, chat. It ended. Break time started. I'll refill my water. See you soon.
Hello everybody, I got water. There you go. 45 seconds till the start. And yeah, I don't know what else to say. 700 players, almost. Nice. The LTUs has recently got much more players than like three months ago, for example. Okay, 20 seconds, 10 more seconds, I'll turn on emote only. Uh, yeah, emote only, guys. Sorry about that, but it has to be done. Um, and uh, yes, I can close the timer because five seconds will pass like bam. Not, not that fast, but you get the point. And there is the next round. <laughs> now. Oh, perfect timing and double black. Okay. Okay. E4, please. Please. E4? D4 something? <laughs> Chad E4, oh my goodness, it happened! No! Oh, oh no! Oh my goodness! Ah, this guy is going for like a drawish line. You better, it would be better if you play D4, honestly. <laughs> There would be more chances there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, chat. This is going to be fun. How to win this? Zero idea so far. I think Castling is fine. Queen 5 have H6. Ah, or G6. G6 weakens the dark squares, though. It's probably H6. Queen G, but Queen G5, it's already pretty much saying, okay, I accept your draw offer. But otherwise, he'll get like F4 and some attack. Hmm. I'll try winning this. He has double pawns, so I guess it's something. At least, maybe. I'll go a6 with a5 in mind for future. I don't really want to play a5 right now because he'll play b. Ah, but now he fixes everything. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't see a way how to even complicate things up. Yeah, that's not quite the e4 I wanted. Hi, Giza Chess. I wanted some fun e4, not, not this e4. Maybe he'll blunder somehow. I don't know. Most likely not, but maybe just somehow. I should have played probably instead of a6. I should have played bishop d7 with a5 idea. 
and then b5 takes so it and at least have a passed pawn because now i i mean we both he not like he has much but yeah there is no even practical chances i think unfortunately i can't triple his pawns i guess i'll do that Okay, he wants to double his pawns. <laughs> not something which, not something that's not the thing which chess players wanna do. But from a trip, if having triple pawns, having double pawn, doubling your pawns is pretty good, I guess. Um, so yeah, I guess I can go to this f6. Yeah, he cannot get anywhere. I cannot get anywhere. I that is that would trap my bishop. And I cannot even push because it would be too risky to try even yeah but okay there was draw pretty much from move I don't know four five or six when he played this e5 I'm pretty sure from then it was a draw f5 f5 king d4 so let's not try that it's a nice nice try from him to get me to play uh, f5 to weaken my pawns but uh, i'm not i'm not gonna go for it i don't even want to try trading the bishops and calculate just 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 move my bishop on the diagonal Pretty much it. F4? I mean, he's the one who can. Play. If I play G4, he gets F4, he's fine. So, just. Okay, draw. Yeah, I was draw from move 6 or 7. <laughs> so, I don't think there was much I could do. I think there was a point where maybe I could have practically played it, but it didn't mean that he had to play a4, but I think practically bishop d7 would be better, so that I have a5 and b5 I take, and after take, 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 I have the a passer, but it uh, would it doesn't mean that after bishop d7 he's forced to go a4, he could simply take, I would be forced to take, how do you win this, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that was a very like yeah exactly. Let's check the accuracy. Wait, my my, ninety eight for PM ninety seven not eight. Yeah, there was even more. There was an E four which is more G four than the D four itself. <laughs> I mean, I'm fortunate, but okay, chat. Uh, there is not much I could do because usually d4 is played here. We should be five. Okay, knight d4. Okay, there is some. Uh, there are some other moves, but uh, but knight d4 is a move. Usually, knight e5 is being played here. And then some crazy lines, which are my secret prep, which I'm not gonna share. But there is, of course, ninety four. We said, oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> unfortunately, I cannot do anything to prevent my opponents from playing that. So, okay. Perhaps here, though. Oh no, chesscom don't lag. Oh, oh, chat. I'm gonna reload because I don't wanna lose another minute of time in a game. Okay. Hopefully it should be fine. What did I want to... What was I talking about? Just call me slagging. Yes. 
I know, but it's lagging based on whatever. Yeah, it was a draw. Let's let's just end it there. It was a draw with not many practical chances. Magnus lost to Jospam. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So now Magnus is fighting for top three. Jospam is half point of uh has half point of lead, so Unlikely that Magnus will catch him. Maybe there will be some people who will catch him, but definitely I don't think Magnus will. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, but Magnus was better. Ah, but he blundered. Yeah, that's what I mean. Sometimes, sometimes I'd rather take a draw than over push like Magnus did here. And lose, you know. A draw is better. A half a half a point is better than zero points. So sometimes, sometimes it's even if you really want to win. But okay, yeah, Magnus just blundered. It wasn't really an over push, I think, because he was better. He was trying to push because he was better. But technically, it's an over push. Technically, it's not. Call it how you'd like. And now queen d5. Queen d5. Oh my goodness. Black me so many. Will white actually hold this? End game. Oh no. How many moves were played already? 91. Four more moves. Five more moves, my bad. Why just has to not blunder the rook in the next five moves? And that's it. I'm worried that white will made themselves. Rook b8. Just play rook b8. Okay. And the next move is a draw. Okay. All right. Okay. Emote only. No, not announce message. What? I said emo, and then it said announce message. <laughs> okay. Let's go e four again. Twenty six sixty five. That's highest rating so far from the tournament. Another Sicilian. D five. Hold on. Bishop b5 because knight of 3 would get bishop g4, but now knight of 3, castle, and a knight e5 idea. Like ninety four. Let's play D three. I want to try to keep my fan cat with bishop because ninety four was interesting, but then bishop of six. I think the bishop trade is unavoidable. Now bishop of six isn't an option because bishop of six, bishop of six, g of f, queen of six. F five though is an option available. For my opponent. B five, okay. Then I'll go rookie one. 
If this rook e2 and then bishop e5 or something like this, c4, rook d4. Okay. I mean, Queen G4 is playing for tr for a trick, but he gets Bishop of six. That, then the trick doesn't really work, so there is no 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 use of Queen G4, I think. Time, 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 time. Ah, Rook G4. He also has C3 idea. it or not but okay c3 is annoying maybe i shouldn't have done rook d4 maybe i shouldn't have played it Hold on, AB or CB is a question. Perhaps AB so I have an open A file, but CB also gives me an open C file. So I don't know about that. Uh, ah, okay, none of them because he didn't take on B3. As a draw, it looks like. I had chances, I think, again, but <laughs> yeah, rookie four, I think, was a bit, a bit, a bit extra. Yeah, because I think I had a super strong bishop, like an archer, and then uh, after rook d4, queen c8, then there was this h5, oh, not h5, c3, c3 idea. So yeah, I think that's where I lost my advantage. Risky there. I'm going to be a little bit cocky. Okay. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, draw. Ah, I think I had about plus one advantage, which I get didn't use, unfortunately. But let's see, maybe I didn't. This bishop was strong, I think I did, but maybe I didn't. Okay, I had exactly plus one when he played c4. Ah, nice! Yeah, okay, I had to take, take... And take. And it's obviously some like plus 0.5. But look at these pins, they're so ugly. <laughs> plus 0.1, yeah, okay. That was pretty drawish, if I do say so myself. But okay, let's hope at least in the last round there will be some fireworks on the board, you know? Let's hope that my opponent plays E4 and BAM! BOOM! Some sacrifices and all that stuff. Because so far a lot of draws today. <laughs> I lost two games. One, I played badly, my opponent played well. Second, it was fun. I misplayed it. I was better, but I misplayed it. Uh... And the other games where I lost points were just draws. <laughs> so, yeah, a lot of draws today. But at least, hopefully end the tournament on a win. Because <laughs> I'm quite tired of draws, you know. Pretty tired of them. Uh, is Hikaru trying to lose this, or is Hikaru trying to lose this? That's a question. Why not knight c3? Would the knight c3 just kill the knight? I think Dominguez is giving Hikaru plenty of chances. Oi, isn't it threefold? Why not King C4? Okay, now King C4, King C5. Hikaru is, I think, going to lose this. King C6. How is this tendons, by the way? Just Pem 9. Magnus drew. Okay, can see seven. Uh, it's Hikaru is. Oh, Hikaru saved that. Oh my goodness! Hikaru actually saved that. <laughs> wow. Why not knight c4? Why doesn't Dominguez like cutting the knight off? I mean, it still would be a draw, but yeah, Hikaru actually saved that. It's crazy. So resourceful he is. Probably the last game of this round, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Alright, chat. Last round. Let's go. Let's have some fireworks on the board, hopefully. Okay. E4. Come on. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. E4. Okay, chat, are we on to something? Are we on to something? Doesn't look too exciting yet, right? <laughs> yeah, I think I think it doesn't. But now, how about now, chat? Huh? Now it's looking more spicy, doesn't it? Like chicken curry, it's getting pretty spicy now. So we started; it was quite calm. Now, hopefully, there will be some spiciness added. You know. Um, 
about my pawn i don't know what to say about it even uh chat i'm not sure if there will be some spiciness uh, how to say uh mm, not sure how to say the best way but uh <laughs> Miss Queen B3. Keep it calm, Jad. No need to worry. It's 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 a sacrifice for content. Not only for content, for fireworks and spiciness, you know? I'm not sure if spiciness is a word, I hope it is. But yes. I mean, so far, I don't say anything, but the queen is a little bit uncomfortable, I hope. At least, gotta hope so. Okay, yes, bishop b3. That's not nice. But then, rook f3, maybe. <laughs> I feel like there has to be some fireworks. Just gotta find out where exactly. Maybe d5. Ooh. This looks very nice. So I cut the bishop, uh, bishop protection of the f3 knight. Maybe simply knight b6 and like queen d6? I don't know. Knight b2 is an option as well, but then queen c2, rook f3. Queen C2, I'm planning Rook F3. I'm not sure how good it will be, but I'm planning it. But maybe I can, if I want to play more calmly, seems like Queen C5 should work. I think. I like that he's thinking. I at least I, I hope that he's not thinking how to win in two moves. <laughs> mm. Okay, let's go for it. Content. I don't see the follow up after G takes F, but I will think a bit and hopefully come up with it. Queen of six. Queen of five. What? What? How do you protect H three? Okay, that was good. That was pretty good. Seven points, not the best result, but I'm happy at least with the final game. It was some nice fireworks. Oh, feels good. Feels good. Sure, I'm probably going to be like 100 something or something even lower, but you know, seven points after a long break is a decent result, I'd say.
Maybe I won't even be a hundred. I mean, probably I will be because there is a bazillion people playing these endpoints and I have quite a lot of tiebreaker. But we'll see. Brilliant. Damn. Oh, that was fun. So, okay. Uh, okay, Queen B C was actually a mistake for me. Bishop B6, I'm better here. I thought I was, but I'm actually plus, uh, plus two, two. I'm plus two. Here I'm plus three. D5 best move. Knight b2 in accuracy. My idea was if he would take, I would take on f3. Thank you so much, Karma, for 500 bits. And I was here to give the tier one sub to h12. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Stockfish isn't happy with it, but practically I just had to go for it. Okay, Stockfish has said to take rook b2. But I thought rook f3 is just so nice. Look at this. The idea is if g takes f9, f4, I'm winning. And then queen g5 is unstoppable. And otherwise, good luck finding how you play against that. Some rook h3 threats in the air. I thought it would be fun. Be yeah, here to go bishop c1, but still, like knight h4, I think it would be some fun there. He played queen c2 and then rook f3, knight h4, queen f6, and that's game over. Okay, seven points, quite fine. Hopefully, I'll be in top 100. I don't know. I have a terrible tiebreaker though, uh, but hopefully, I'll be in top 100. Oh, but there's also people with six and a half points I forgot about. Fair enough. Maybe I won't be in top 100 chat. <laughs> there's a lot of people with six points. So, yeah, I doubt that I'll be in top 100. If I'll be in top 100, I'll be happy. Um, but I think I play decent games. Let's see how many draws, wins, losses. Two losses. A zillion draws, a million wins. Well, a million draws, some wins. I got uh, four draws, two losses, and five wins. Pretty decent. Where I drew, I mean, you see, 98.3 for both, 98 for both, 97.5 for both, and 95.7 for both. So it was pretty drawn game. Where I lost, my opponent played extremely well. I played badly, but my opponent played very well. And another game where I lost, I played super, super well. But... There is a big, big but. I uh, I got too carried away. I, I just got such a beast on d5. And I got too too excited. And then I played, not too carelessly, I played too romantic, let's say. <laughs> and then I ended up, I mean, I was still fine. And then I made just a one move blunder, I blunder, shoot d4 check. Otherwise, I would be fine. Thank you so much for 500 more bits. Thank you. Thank you so much, Sorgan. First of all, for a tier one for how many months? Uh, for 22 months, then 10 gifted subs, and then also 500 bits. Really appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. Still some games left. Let's see if I'll be in top 100 or not. I doubt it, but maybe. Yeah, this should be a draw, but I'm more or less happy with the games. Okay, where, where there were draws, I pretty much had no chances. Again, Sako Chess, maybe I had something, maybe I had something, but uh, yes, I had Rook C7 winning a pawn. Yes, I had something, but I I know, okay, I know it's just the reasoning that I, I, I was fine on time, but I started the game, Chess got blacked, and I lost a minute. So, that's just the reason I had Rook C7, I missed it, there was... And in the other games where I drew, it was pretty much a draw for for whole game. So, it's quite fine. The only game I'm a bit disappointed is this game. And Chris Demirich gave the deal and community sub and Johnny Oates got it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Chris Demirich. Thank you guys for the support. I appreciate it very, very much. Final game of the tournament is ending in a matter of seconds and there it is okay am i in top 100 i am what place am i or is it around 12 today or is this game still going ah this game is still going okay i thought there was only 12th round today i was a bit like oops <laughs> Uh, just come bugged out, but you can see the small board. 
where the game is still going. Certainly not the best the existence. <laughs> they have to make it then 1 plus 0. Okay, what place did I get? 95th! Okay, let's double check. Let's double check that. Uh, yeah, I was pretty much just like half a point out of a decent result, out of top 50, pretty much. So, I know. Oh, yeah, I am 95th. Ooh, I'm drop 100. I'm quite happy. Didn't around, but with a. Ah, oh, yeah, that is true. Very, very, very true, Pookie. Where is Magnus? Did he reach? Oh, he lost. I'm just one point away from Magnus, guys. So that was a good tournament, you know. Magnus just had one more point. So yeah, that was a good tournament. <laughs> All right, chat. That was fun. Uh, sure, maybe could have done a bit better, but still 10 points, quite decent. In the drawn games, except one, I had no chances. In the lost game, in one, I didn't have chances. In one, I played two. Too romantic, as Sweet Alien would say. So I'm pretty happy with the tournament. Thank you so, so much, everybody, for the support. Crash Dummy Rich gifted a tier one sub, then also subbed for seven months. Anonymous gifted, gifted three, three subs to Naki Pulahan. Baragel Magnus and community sub, then Lorgan 500 bits, 22 months at tier 1, and also 10 gifted subs. Thank you very, very much. And then Karmar 500 bits and 70 months at tier 3. Bimi Absolutely gifted our tier 1 sub to Pookie and resubbed at tier 1 for 5 years, so 60 months. And Panda. Uh, three, uh, 52 months at tier 3. Thank you very, very much for the support, everybody. Also, when I was in stream, I'm an anonymous gifter for is giving a lot of subs. No, I'm not playing late title Tuesday. This is late. And late title Tuesday is like extra late. It, I think, starts like 11 or 10. No, goodness me. 11 or midnight. And it goes until like 1, 1 or 2 a.m. It's too late. This is already pretty late, but... Fortunately for us, soon there will be summertime, and I think Tile Tuesday will start at 5. There will be more fun. So, I hope you enjoyed the stream, everybody. Thank you so, so much for the support and for watching. Have a great rest of your day, and let's see who I will rate. Early 11 p.m. Yeah, that's your time. Here is plus one. So, I think it's even... Oh, they changed raid settings, didn't they? I see Anna Maya... Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Probably Anamaya. Yeah. I think I'll read Anamaya. So, guys, thank you so, so much for the support. Take care, everybody. Bye, Pookie. You're plus one. Are you CET Pookie or no? I think I'm GMT plus two here. I am not exact. Oh, Anamaya ended. All right, chat. Then we are not trading Anamaya. Uh... I think it's Ketty. I don't know. If you if you want me to read anybody, let me know. Ah, the big Greek. Let's probably read the big Greek. Uh, I think it's plus two here. Yeah, I think so. So it's at midnight. It's pretty late. Uh, so yeah, everybody. Take care, everybody. Thank you so, so much for the support. Bye, 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 Pookie. Bye to Bledchick. Bye, Bimi Absotti. Bye, Karma. Bye, the 17th piece. Bye, Lorgan. Bye, bye. Uh, Crash Dummy Reach, by 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 Akira's Planet, by Biagio Biagin, by 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 Baragel Magnus, by by Ion Novis, by by Bimi Up Snotty, and everybody who was here have a fantastic crazy day. Bye, Kanimanara, and I'll catch you all next time. Take care, everybody, and bye bye.